Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Jacob Restituto. I'm a musician from Northport, New York, and today we are reacting to breaking down a very popular track off SB19's new album that came out a couple months ago, which I broke down the entire album if you want to go check that out. But a bum. <laughs> and I actually had an interview with Simon Servita who produced the whole album. But a bum. <laughs> so go check out those things. But that being said, we're going to be checking out one of the most popular tracks from that album. Everybody loved it. It was a crazy track. It was Bazinga, uh, which I am. This premiered two days ago. Uh, and it has, or three days ago technically, and it's almost a million views on the channel, which is amazing. I am so excited for them. Like, the fact that their music videos getting that many views, like that is so crazy cool. Speaking of music videos, you guys have been blowing up the music videos and then songs on my channel, and I'm so, I just wanna say thank you. And if you wanna continue to, please do so. It would mean the world to me. Here's a little snip of one of the tracks. Just get me. So thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed that. Please go check it out if you want to support the channel uh, or subscribe in any other ways you want to support. That being said, this is SB19 Bazinga. One of the things I want to point out, I love, this is brilliant. And, uh, par and partly uh, also the fact that you could tell if they're like getting some notoriety is because look at this branding. Pepsi, this this is not intentional. There's no way because like you wouldn't you I, I don't know if you've noticed this, but you've actually in a lot of music videos you'll sometimes see things blurred out like T-shirts blurred out or brands of water bottles turned so you can't see because you can't necessarily associate. But when you do, it's so distinct. Look at the branding of this. This is this is brilliant, and I I'm a marketing guy. I love marketing, so I think this is cool because. But the reason it's, I'm not I think it's cool is because the reason that I do think it is cool is because it's showing that brands are starting to care about SB19 and think it's worth their investment in investing in them. The Pepsi bought the Pepsi back we back here full of Pepsi that you have the different members one one of them I apologize I I don't I haven't learned all their names yet. So I think that that's Pablo holding the red controller right there. I, I haven't learned all their names yet, and I do apologize. I, should, I, I need to get on that. But the other one is holding the blue Pepsi color again, not intention, not um, not unintentional. The games right in the center that are blurred out, blue, white, and red, all Pepsi colors, and I think that is brilliant. The blue back here and the paintings, like it's good marketing, man. It's good marketing. Let's see what we got. This is Bazinga. Oh, him grabbing a Pepsi. It, oh my gosh! Look, look at this. There's so much brand, like, it's called product placement, and it's, like, supposed to be, like, subliminal messaging, saying, like, that, oh, they're using Pepsi. It's not like, hey, guys, buy Pepsi. It's it's SB19 passing Pepsi to each other. Like, he's passing the Pepsi. It's brilliant, man. It's good marketing with the blue and red right here. It's And him wearing blue and red. There's so much thought that went into this. I admire it. But it's not like, it, it, I don't mind it. I, and 99% of people that are not... Um, into marketing would never notice it, but they'd subliminally check out or notice. Oh, hey, they have they like the, in their back of their mind they 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 think when they see Pepsi they, they might subliminally think of SB19. You know what I mean? Or associate the two together, or just be like, you know, I could go for a Pepsi. I'm not no totally notice why. That's so good, man. I love it. That is so good. Yo, Hitler production. Look at the quality of the video. It's so good. It's my grotto. Yo, massive budget for this video. This is wild, killer quality. Let me just refresh this. This is at 918, 357. View count. I just want to see. I, I I don't. I think I might have this a couple days ago. So I just want to see how much higher. Yeah. So no, that's it's five thousand more views since the last. Time. I, maybe it was a couple. Not a couple days, but it was actually maybe a couple hours. Uh, that's crazy. Nine twenty three now views. This is wild. Uh, so where were we? We were right here. Yeah. Sliding up those synths is so wild. Bruce, be proud. Huge layer vocals. Oh, little CGI. Don't you see? Don't you see? This is my legacy, legacy. Now, how you gonna get 
Digital things in the background, almost like radio waves. Oh, how would they do that? Is this all in the same studio? That's pretty wild, actually. There's so many different stages for this video. It's like, I'm pumped for them, man. This is so cool. Big reverb, man. So crazy. I wonder if this is gonna get more views than what? 13 million views on that video. That was a close transition, but again, like CGI, this stuff isn't like it takes a lot of work, man. All these effects are crazy. Yo, this is a wild, wild video, man. This is so insane. Heavy bass. I like this like slow motion kind of like just showing the guys as they're before it gets crazy kind of like it's like almost like a breath like it's not a lot of crazy motion but before it gets crazy then it's gonna go oh I apologize I forgot to put on this closed caption I'm sorry I'll put him on now I apologize see now it's starting to get crazy again oh that's 4k right there by the way this, these dimensions are 4k which you can see right here I guess. <laughs> the bop. Jumping up the Oscars in that scene. Oh, that's cool. That's fun, man. That's cool. I like that. That was a great video. That was a really, really entertaining video. I really genuinely enjoyed that. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed that. Thank you so much for watching. I Again, back to the Pepsi. I, th I think that's great because it just shows that brands now believe in them and are willing to put their money where their mouth is with SB19. I'm pumped to see their growth. Uh, if anybody has any connections where they're able to you know, hook me up with an interview with any of them, I would love that opportunity. Or anybody connected to them, I would love the opportunity to talk to them. Check out the Simon Servita interview. Check out, I actually have two with him. Uh, if you haven't seen the whole reaction to their Holy Peak, go check that out. If you want to check out my music, it is the best way to support the channel. I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a wonderful rest of your day. God bless and peace out, fam.